we have redemption through His blood. Praise God. Amen. We can celebrate that. Hello there. This is Pastor Pete Pavelic. Thank you so much for joining me for this edition of The Daily Devo. As always, I would invite you to come over to my website and uh, visit with me there. Connect with me there. Check out all the resources there. PastorPete.org. I'll say it again before we conclude our podcast today. PastorPete.org. Ephesians chapter 1, verse 7 through 10. That's where I've been reflecting, celebrating, praising God this day, and I would invite you to turn your attention there for a few minutes with me today as well. Here is what it says in verse 7, In Him we have redemption through His blood, the forgiveness of our trespasses according to the riches of His grace, that He richly poured out on us with all wisdom and understanding. He made known to us the mystery of His will according to His good pleasure that He purposed in Christ as a plan for the right time to bring everything together in Christ, both things in heaven and things on earth in Him. He brought heaven and earth together through the blood of Jesus, and we can celebrate because in Him we have redemption through His blood, the forgiveness of our trespasses, the forgiveness of our sins according to the riches of His grace. We can celebrate that today. No matter what is going on in your life today, no matter how hard today is going to be, how anxious you are about whatever's coming your way today, um, how, how fearful you are of what's coming tomorrow or next week, we can celebrate and we can focus our minds and focus on our hearts on this good news that we are sons and daughters, children's, children of God. And according to verse 11, he says, we also have received an inheritance as these children of God who have been redeemed by the blood of Jesus. And so I just want to remind you today, church, that you are loved, you are cherished, you are valued. God sent his son into the world to redeem you, to redeem you because he loves you. He loves you that much. He bled for you. He bled for me. We are redeemed by his blood through the forgiveness of of our trespasses and our sins. What an amazing thing that is. So may you take hold of that today. May it give you courage and strength and fortitude for whatever you're facing. Take hold and remember you are a child of God. Nobody can take that away from you. The devil can't snatch that away from you. Nobody can snatch that away. You are safe in the hands of God. And so I want to encourage you not only to embrace that, but I want to encourage you to share that. I want you I want to encourage you to speak that into somebody's life. I want to encourage you to pray that over somebody's life before you wrap your quiet time up today. Just pray for a friend or a family member maybe that's going through a tough time that they would be reminded of this truth right here. Praise God. Amen. We can celebrate this. I hope you have a great day, an incredible day. Go check it out. Ephesians chapter 1 verses 7 through 10. Until tomorrow, and I look forward to seeing you again tomorrow. May the Lord bless you. Share this post. Come over and visit me at pastorpete.org.